Want to get all the skills in Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order to become extremely powerful and get the still pretty rare achievement or trophy? Well, I got some awesome XP farm tactics that will help you get those skill points in no time. So let's get into it. Would be awesome if you could leave a like on the video as it shows your support. And let's go. Before we take a look at my favorite XP farm tactic on Datamir, I first want to give a quick shout out to one Swedish gamer for reaching out to me on Twitter at Yoraptor with this XP farm tactic that he found. So it's over here on the map in Kashyyyk and I've said before how you can get here like in previous videos but a quick reminder, a quick rundown is that you want to get to this familiar location by using the shuttle from your ship then the elevator in the outdoor area from the elevator we want to go to the right and then you get to this area again we want to slow this thing to get across and then we want to use this elevator kill the mini gun a trooper by just pushing him away the purge trooper is there too and then just follow this path through the jungle that in the end will lead you to this meditate point and this is somewhere where you will get to eventually by playing through the story but then you can easily go back. So from the meditate points, we want to go to the left and then jump up this platform where we have one of those slikes and I hope I pronounced that right. Thanks to the jump, you can easily take this creature out with an air attack. And if you unlock the skill that increases your lightsaber damage, then this will be enough to instantly take out the target. Otherwise, you have to still do some slices to take it out. And you can actually kill it like instantly on every difficulty because the health of the enemies is not different per difficulty in this game. But yeah, the lightsaber damage upgrade is really nice and needed for this tactic to make it go way faster. So then you can just kill this creature with an air slash use the plant to go back to the meditate point and then rinse and repeat. It takes like 25 seconds per run and the XP is pretty decent. So thanks again to one Swedish gamer for reaching out to me about this. I put a link to his channel in the video description for if you want to check it out. Now on to that other XP farm tactic that I've actually been using a lot. So I already mentioned in my previous video that on Datamir you can get some really great XP. And that's because these enemies simply give a ton of XP because it's a rather late game area while you can already get there from the first planet. The first meditate point you encounter on this planet after swinging to the other side is great. So you start there and then take out the many weapon and bow wielding enemies that give quite a lot of XP. So one tactic is to just do this whole run through this structure inside the building fight the many enemies and then even the archers like that at the end will be shooting you from afar and then if you go up you actually get to the meditate point again and then you can do this tactic over and over again but yeah these encounters can be tough though it's not like an easy way to farm XP because it does require a lot of energy and focus also later on in the game when you return to Datamir for the story these enemies will actually disappear so then this tactic is not available anymore. But luckily there's a better one that is close by. So for this one you need to double jump that you get by just playing through the story. And then go over here on the map. It's actually at the meditate point that you reach by sliding close to the point where you met the wanderer. So you jump to the other platforms. But instead of going straight and climbing up. You want to fall down and then slide down to reach this spot. Now we want to kill these bugs very easily by using your force push maybe once or twice. And then just use this elevator that you also unlock by just playing through this area for the main story. Now we want to go to the right because there you will find three enemies who are just chilling there. And what you want to do is just push them off the platform so they instantly die. This will give you a ton of XP and then just immediately go back to the elevator and to the meditate point to rest and let all the enemies respawn. You need the howling push ability though for this one to be able to push all the enemies away with just one attack because your regular force push won't be able to do that. But yeah, totally unlock this one and you can easily do it by just farming some enemies and then just repeat this tactic over and over again. Push the bugs, take the elevator push the enemies off the cliff again and sometimes you might miss like then one enemy will just stay on the platform you can just finish the job then with your lightsaber or try and push 
so that the enemy in the end falls. And I got the power of friendship skill too, that makes it so that I get my force back after using a stim. So then I can just spam my force abilities to have them all die very easily. And then you will get the skill points, all the skills and the trophy and achievements in no time. Subscribe for everything Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order, like this video to support the channel and check out my recent video on all the legendary beasts and where to find them and I will also share tips on how to take them out or more secrets that you totally want to get. There are a ton of Star Wars videos on the channel, have fun and I will speak to you next time, goodbye!